Hey guys, back with another video, and uh, today we are going to talk about uh, how protein supplements could be beneficial for those who are vegetarians and vegans who have limited sources of protein uh, uh, for them to have throughout the day, and how they can uh, benefit from supplements to reach to that protein uh, intake limit especially if they are in a weight loss phase okay so uh, when we talk about protein protein is the primary builder you know the primary source of uh, building tissues building uh, building muscle tissue joint uh, ligaments uh, in your body and that is why it is one of the most essential macronutrient among carbohydrates fats and uh, proteins uh, if you will when it comes to weight loss, uh, why protein is emphasized is because A, it keeps you full, okay, because when we talk about a protein source, proteins in general have the property of keeping you full or keeping you satiated, if you will. When you say satiated, if you have substantial amount of protein, then there is less room for other stuff to fill in at a certain mean, right? Uh, even for a longer duration, if, let's say if I've had uh, a good protein source for my breakfast, in the next three or four hours, I'm not liable to feel hungry, okay? And that is one of the reasons why my total calories will be low because I won't feel that much hungry. Uh, say for instance, if I've had uh, cottage cheese for breakfast, as against if I've just had uh, maybe a rice cakes. Uh, secondly, uh, why protein source is uh, very important uh, for weight loss? Because weight loss can happen either by losing muscle tissue or lean tissue. Second, by losing fat. Okay, So when you are not eating adequate protein, you are only eating less of whatever you used to eat, there are chances that body takes out squeezes out the energy from the lean tissue or your muscle tissue and your fat is not utilized as much and when that happens there is a phenomenon known as skinny fat and no one would want to go there okay. so that is the main reason why protein is important now why protein supplements can be beneficial we have to look at the per gram or, or the density of protein in the foods that uh, we as vegetarians are eating. Uh, the prime sources, the most common sources of protein that we eat, cottage cheese, lentils, dal, pulses, beans, legumes, soy chunks. We have to understand how much protein value are we getting per gram of that food source. For example, in a cooked lentil or cooked uh, pulses or even cooked beans, a hundred gram of a bowl will have roughly around eight to ten grams of protein. Majority of it is carbohydrate. In a hundred gram of cottage cheese, we have around eighteen to twenty odd grams of protein. Majority of it is fat. Now, <coughs> if I uh, place my meals accordingly and I have dedicatedly have cottage cheese, lentils, pulses, beans, soy, nuts uh, into my meal every single day on a fat loss phase, I'm not, not only am I not getting my adequate protein of 2 to 2.5 grams per kilogram of body weight, okay, which if I am a 70 kilogram person, uh, my protein intake is roughly around, should be roughly around 140 to 160 grams. Okay, it's, it's huge and why it should be huge as I said because you don't want room for anything else and because you don't want your hard earned muscle tissue or lean tissue to burn you want your fat to be burned so to hit that 140 to 160 grams of protein <clears throat> if I hog on to all uh, you know 200 300 grams of, pun of uh, cottage cheese and 200 grams of couple of bowls of dal which is practically not easy and not possible also for majority of us for 90% 95% of us it is not possible 
because eating humongous amounts of cottage cheese will keep you full for the entire day. Okay, uh, even if you if you we are only having that okay? because we are having a source of protein with a source of carb and with a source of fat to keep it sustainable for a longer duration because sustainability and adherence is also very important. So if I have let's say 100 grams of cottage cheese, 100 grams of uh, nuts, 100 grams of uh, lentils and 100 grams of beans in my entire 4 meal per day uh, uh, timeline. I am only getting roughly at around 20, another 20, another 20, another 10, so you, you count this roughly around 100 or maybe lesser, 90, 80, 80 to 100 grams of protein. Okay, because and also uh, along with that, if I try to increase my intake of all these sources, what am I increasing? Yes, I am increasing my protein but along with it the prime sources fat carbohydrates are also increasing on top of that what is it's going to do it's going to increase the total number of calories if you're trying to hit a 2000 calorie goal for your weight loss daily overeating on these sources because they are the prime sources of things of stuff other than protein they are going to increase your calories even though you're hitting your protein Okay, so why protein supplements come into picture now? Protein supplements will come into picture because they have a huge density of protein. Per gram of that particular supplement will have 75 to 80 percent of protein. Okay, you take a scoop, it's 30 grams, you're getting around 20 to 25 grams. Of its 35 grams, you're getting 25 to 30 grams of protein. So it's roughly 80, 75 to 80 percent of majority of the protein supplements that you have uh, in the market. So if I'm having uh, my my prime sources of vegetarian protein, my cottage cheese, lentils, beans, and I add one scoop of my whey protein into my meal per day, not only am I not increasing calories hugely because one scoop is roughly around 120, 130 calories on an average but I am also getting another 25 to 30 grams of protein on top of what I was eating. So I am not increasing my calorie limit per day but I am increasing my protein. You get the point. So that is why protein supplements could be beneficial especially for those who are vegetarians and vegans. And also uh, for weight loss uh, the more protein you have remember the more satiety the more fat you are going to burn. So guys, uh, if you have any queries, do reach out in the comment section. I am happy to help.